Hey guys, it's Nina here and welcome back to my channel. I am here today in the beautiful De Palm. Me and Jay are actually here for a staycation. It's our 8th year anniversary. Yep, we've actually passed the 7 year itch. And hopefully things are just gonna get better and better as the year goes by. And who knows, this might be the year that, you know, I'm gonna get pregnant. But yes, please do pray for us. But today is all about a makeup tutorial. This is not a vlog. I'm gonna show you guys how I created this look. This is actually a quick and easy makeup look for whenever you're traveling or when you're on vacation. This might look like a lot but it really isn't. I even used my fingers to put some of the products. This is gonna be a very easy, I promise you, an easy makeup tutorial. <laughs> If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Nina Carpio. If you like what you see so far, please consider subscribing by hitting that red subscribe button down there as well as the bell button so that you're notified whenever there's a new video that comes out. Also, you can follow me on Instagram at smilelikenina. All right, let's get started. Okay, so to start this staycation makeup, I'm using Dr. Jard. This is the BB cream. So usually when I'm on vacation, I don't really have a lot of heavy foundation with me. I usually have BB creams most of the time. So it's a BB cream or a very, very light foundation. What I love about this is it has SPF 45 PA++ plus plus plus, and it has whitening and anti-wrinkle. I'm just using my hands right now. But of course you can use your sponge as well. I wasn't able to bring my sponge. is a concealer so this is the Maybelline age rewind so everything I have is like it has anti-aging on it I'm just gonna put I don't know if you can see and again I'm just gonna blend that with my fingers it would have been nice if I brought my sponge but yeah it happens if I feel like I'm gonna be out in the sun, I wouldn't put this concealer on because I'm gonna have my shades anyway. So if you don't want to put concealer, that's totally fine. So after the concealer, I use my cream blush. As much as possible, I don't use any powder. You're out in the sun, you really don't want to put a lot of makeup on your face. Again, you can use your fingers like... Or I have my brush with me. So I'm just gonna put that... There you go. Oh no, I'm running out of battery. It's flashing right in front of me. <laughs> We're back. My concealer in, my blush in. I'm just gonna set my concealer with a powder and I'm using this mini brush by Real Techniques. This is actually a contour brush, but I like using it under my eyes. It fits perfectly over there. I'm using my under eye brightening powder. This is by Laura Mercier. I'm just gonna tap that in there. So this is all the powder that I'm going to put in my face, to be honest. Okay. And I'm going to do my brows. And I'm actually using a new um, pomade for my eyebrows. And this is by Immaculate Beauty. I actually prefer this now more than my Anastasia Beverly Hills because this one doesn't dry out. Even if I leave this open, it doesn't dry out. And like what I said, I like the pomade more. I feel like I can manipulate it more than a pencil. So this is by Immaculate Beauty. I don't know if they have an online shop. They have one in Oasis Mall. I think it's called Pro Makeup Boutique. So you can get that from there. Eyebrows are done. And I can actually use this as an eyeliner as well. So I'll do that. <laughs> And I'm just gonna smudge it on the top of my eyes. So I don't put anything on my eyes, but um, I make sure that I have a lot of colorful lipsticks. When I'm out in the sun, because I don't put a lot of makeup, but I make sure that I have like my lips are talking. What I'm putting right now is Recollection by MAC. This is a gorgeous purple. <laughs> Let me just quickly blow dry my hair and then come back, okay. So I'm just gonna put the highlighter very quickly on the tip of my nose, the bridge of my nose, and then just here on the high points of your face.
Okay, let me go back to blow drying my hair. I just pop on some lashes just to complete the, the look, but it's optional. If you don't want it, then it's okay. All right, so that's it for the makeup tutorial. I hope you learned something. And if you have any comments on probably how you do your makeup whenever you're on vacation, please feel free to let me know down below. I'd love to learn from you guys. And hopefully you can give me some tips too. It's, you know, we're helping each other out here. Thank you guys for tuning in to my channel and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye for now. Keep smiling.